Pierce College opened the South Sound's first science dome and planetarium in the fall of 2012 on Pierce's Fort Stillicum campus. The reaction from, from people who come into the dome is wow, they're really amazed by it. It is a, a great tool, it's a great experience to be in there. I was completely awestruck. I couldn't believe it. I sat down in the chairs and um, Hillary turned on the stars and made the aurora happen and it was, it was amazing. The 58-seat theater uses two projectors to show images on the 38-foot dome ceiling, which enhances students' learning experience. The college wanted to build the Science Dome as a way to enhance student learning. A lot of times we have concepts in science that students can't quite understand because they're very complex and they can't see the movement or the motion or the relationships with each other, and the Science Dome is one way to let those students see that. It's an awesome tool. It's really, I'm really excited about it. It already has, we've already been using it in classes and it's just amazing. Uh, you can see that the students are getting concepts before where it was so hard to project something on a flat screen where they can see it. Um, it helps a lot with that spatial reasoning. The dome can be used to look at the night sky and you can go anywhere on earth or anywhere in space to look at any, any time or any place in space. But watching it in the science dome because of how it's set up and you're just laying back and you're looking up, it's almost like you get a chance to forget what's going on outside and you just get to watch what's going on on the screen. It's almost like you're, you're in the picture or you're in a spacecraft flying by all the planets and so you're just immersed in it. We also have a variety of full dome videos Many of their great temples and monuments were accurately aligned to objects in the sky and towered above the earth as if to touch the stars themselves. That we can put up on the dome and the videos range from various topics through flying through the Egyptian pyramids to um, looking at the human body to other space related things, um, going underneath the ocean and looking at wildlife there. The state of Washington built the Rainier Building which houses the Science Dome. But without the support from the community and from the Pierce College student government, the Science Dome would not have been built. The Science Dome was a vision of Pierce College and the college partnered with the Pierce College Foundation to fundraise for the equipment to go inside the dome. The curved ceiling, the projector, the reclining seats, the high-end sound system. Our donors were very excited to hear about the building of the Science Dome and they really clamored at the opportunity to be a part of the project. Uh, to be the only Science Dome in the South Sound was a big draw. Uh, they also had a real appreciation for the fact that we need to get more students excited about about science, technology, engineering, and math, and even little kids at a younger age. The Pierce College Science Dome will be a learning environment for everyone in the South Sound. We want to do an outreach to K-12 students to get them interested in science and math and technology. Um, and we will also unit, use it as a place for community members to come in and learn astronomy, um, different various shows that can be seen throughout that, and to really understand what the college community is about and to just enhance our cultural well-being in our community. We'll have public events a couple times a year, and we also have public shows that are on the evenings and on the weekends. Evening and weekend shows will be open for the community to continue their lifelong learning. You can find out about the Science Dome activities by going to the Pierce College website.